Hello, Leah. Hello, teacher. How are How you, are Leah? You? I'm okay, thank you. What about you? I'm fine. I'm fine. Here's uh, working. It's hot today, huh, Leah? Good evening. I'm Hello. Sorry. It's hot today. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Hello, Mr. Molina. Yes. Hello. How are you? Lou, you're back. What happened yesterday, Lou? Good evening, everybody. Uh, sorry for yesterday. I go out with my family to dinner. It, right. And we come later. Sorry. No, it's okay. Cool. That's good. Well, it was something productive. <laughs> it's always it is productive. What you do? Uh, we come. We go to eat. Uh, Mexican food. Mexican food. Yes. Where? Uh, my. Uh, siempre olvido esta palabra. Mi tío. My uncle. My uncle um, loves Mexican food, uh, so we go a restaurant. He knows. I don't know where it is, but it is very uh, small and comfortable. <laughs> okay. Where? What? In Antigua? No. Uh, I don't know. Uh, me, vamos con mi familia in her his, uh, in his car. Um, okay. We always close eyes and ahí estamos. <laughs> okay. In a blink of an eye. Um, I recommend you, there's a really, really, really good Mexican restaurant and it's not very expensive. It's called Andale in Antiguo Cuscatlán. It's very good. My uncle loves Antiguo Cuscatlán, as you can. Maybe I, I was there. I tell her, uh, he's, he's there. Yeah. They. <laughs> yeah, it's in a corner. It's very, very good. I mean, the burritos are very big. Like, I love burritos. I love um, those burritos. And those are those burritos that when you eat, they chorean yeah. because they're big. <laughs> Oh my, my favorite, God. my favorite restaurant, uh, Mexican restaurant, uh, is um, El Zócalo. El Zócalo is oh, good. It's delicious, delicious. <laughs> it's the best, the best. No, For go me. to Andale. Go to Andale one day. You'll see. It's a good competition. Really, it's better. No. What what it's I feel, cheap. what I feel like in in Zócalo, because it's so big, it's like. The food ya está como precocida, you know, like just to, you know, and in, 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 in Andale, maybe it's, in, it's more in the moment, instant, macacera, like. Yes. Maybe okay. that's how I feel. No, but, but Zócalo is very good. For me, so, yes. it, for me, maybe it was my favorite Mexican restaurant until oh. I went to Andale. Andale. <laughs> maybe I will, I will go. Yeah, try oh, it. I will to go. Mm -hmm. I will go. Mm -hmm. I will go. All right. Hello, Jocelyn, Sophia. Oh, so your name is Sophia. Hey, Jocelyn. Yes, but I don't like Sophia. <laughs> oh, okay. Nice. Hello, Luis Molina. How are you? Ah, uh, everything okay, teacher. Yeah. You yeah. and like always, you look like you're in a in a bunker. Bunker. <laughs> in a bunker. Ba bunker. Como yeah. una cueva, I see, like. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Or you look like you're in the moon. I look in alone. space, like an astronaut. Uh huh. Like, hello, um, Earth. Hello. <laughs> Marlon, how are you? <laughs> Hi, teacher. How are good. you, Marlon? Uh, good, teacher. How, what did you do today, sir? Uh, sorry, perdón. What did you do today? Uh, uh, no sé cómo podría decirlo en inglés, pero sí, he estado bastante ocupado realmente. 
I was very busy today. <laughs> <laughs> I was very busy today. Oh. Repeat, Marlon. Please repeat, Marlon. I was <laughs> very busy today. I, I was very busy today. No, I was very busy today. Ah, okay, okay. I was very busy today. There you go. Oh, thank wow. you. Cool. <laughs> okay, thank you. What about you, Evelyn? Hello. Um, sorry, yesterday I can't connect. It's okay. Because I, I have to work too late. I don't know if it's correct. That oh, yes, that's it's a correct. Tarde? I had to work until late. Oh, until late. Um, but I'm here <laughs> again. Okay. I'm sorry, Evelyn. Where do you work? You told me, but I forgot. Uh, I work in, I work in Telus. <laughs> oh, yeah. You work in yeah. Telus. I IT, IT right? department. Yes. Are Are you working in the building? Yes, uh, I'm. I'm on site right now in Merliot. Oh really? How many people are there in Merliot now? Mm, around two hundred persons, because other they come is working from home in this moment. Mm -hmm. I am in Google. Yes, I remember. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I, I think I'm, I'm going to be in until January or February, maybe. Yes, uh, um, my boss tell us that some accounts come back until the next year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like working from home now, though. <laughs> I, I I like it. I like to <laughs> um, the the first no. How do you say? At the beginning, the, I did. At the beginning, I, I I working from home. I was working from home, but now around two months ago, mm -hmm. I I am on site. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And where do you live? Um, here I live in Sayapango. Wow, you live far from. Yes, I I around one hours and okay. half. You travel by traffic. bus. Um, no, by car. One hour and a half by car. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> and that's that's with pandemia. Imagine with no pandemia, the traffic. Oh. Uh, is more. When when I when I was on site, when when there was no pandemic, when there was no pandemic, before the pandemic, before the pandemic, I um I take a, a I take a bus, and I take around two hours in bus. Wow. Yes. Oh. Well. And um, so you're on site in this moment, and uh, what time do you get off? Um, around six a.m. Wow. No, 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 five a.m. <laughs> I I I live here five, uh, six a.m. to the work. I imagine when you get out, you might do this. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool though. I, I, I used to be in Merliot. Now we're in Cascadas, but I, I prefer Merliot. Sure. Yeah. Yes. Uh, after um, when the last years Google is in Google Translate? No, Translate. Oh, ¿cómo se dice moverse a Cascadas? Moved. Moved to Cascadas. I'm very happy. I won twenty dollars in Ugo today in my job. Oh, uh, sorry, repeat. Today I won a twenty dollars certificate in Ugo. Ah, congratulations! <laughs> Thank you. And you know, and you know what? I didn't know that. I sure. didn't know, but it was a raffle with Rifa uh -huh. of people whose birthday is in November. Uh -huh. uh, and my birthday was November too. So, but I didn't. And then my my supervisor texts me. So David, 
have you answered your email? I said, what email? You have to accept that you won the Ugo. I'm, oh my God. And I, oh my God. $20. That, that's amazing. <laughs> yes. But, Irene, Irene, today is, is her birthday too. Oh, nice. Yes, but she can connect today. <laughs> oh, she, she has to celebrate. <laughs> yes. Um, so tomorrow, I told my wife that I'm going to invite her for for lunch. Pero no Eso. sabe que voy a pagar con Hugo. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Tomorrow, tomorrow is my birthday. Tomorrow's your birthday, Victor. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Happy wow, so we have three November people in this class. Oh, yes. So you're still sing, a Scorpio, Victor. Sing. Sing. Yep. <laughs> well, how, how old are you going to be, Victor? 26. Actually, the correct form is how old are you going to turn? You're going to be 26. Yep. Cool. Let me teach you something real quick before we start. Look at the chat. Do you see that early, mid, late? Yes. An apostrophe S? Yes. 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 Okay, um, this is what that means. Let me see. Evelyn. Yes. I'm sorry, Evelyn, how old are you? 34. Okay, so Evelyn, you are in your mid 30s. Okay. Do you understand that concept? Mid thirties. How? Mm. Okay, listen to this. Listen to this. Mm -hmm. Lia, si en español yo le pregunto, ¿cuántos años tienen ahí Bukele? Eh, <clears throat> I don't know, 40, 40. I don't know. No. Approximately. 38. 38. No, 38. Vaya. Okay, 38. Vaya. <laughs> oh, okay. Ok, en español nosotros contestamos con un número exacto, aunque lo estamos aproximando. Uh -huh. Entonces, en inglés sería early, que es temprano, mid, medio, y late, tarde. Entonces, solo le ponemos el enta. Entonces, unos dijeron 38, son, how old is Nayib Bukele? O sea, en español, sí, sería, no ¿cuántos años tiene Nayib Bukele? Él tiene... No sé, 38, 39. 49. 40. Oh, I'm looking at Google already. Yep. Okay, thank you, Victor. <laughs> La idea era que no, no supieran <laughs> solo que. Pero, pero, it's okay, thank you. Entonces, pero en inglés, you say, How old is Nay Bukele? Uh, maybe late 30s. Y ahí uno It's ya tiene no la idea. ¿Hm? Los 40s o los 80s? No, Nayib, okay, so listen. Okay, so oh. Evelyn is 34. So let's say 30, 31, 32, and 33 is early mm -hmm. 30s. 30, yeah. 34, 35, 36, mm -hmm. mid 30s. Yeah. 37, 38, 39, late 30s. Mm -hmm. Y lo mismo para 20s. 50s, 60s. Okay. So I am, I am late 20. No, you're in your mid, mid. Uh, you're 26 tomorrow. You're, you're in your mid 20s. Okay. Bueno, fácil. De 20 al 29, dividilo en tres. Los primeros tres son early. Three, six. Early. Early. Mm -hmm. early. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Los siguientes tres son mid y los otros son mes. Good tip. Yeah. <laughs> so, for example, so entonces, um, un ejemplo, eh, gracias Evelyn por contarme, pero a veces 
eh, si alguien no quiere la, decir la edad o algo así, solo dice, how old are you? Oh, I'm in my mid 40s, uh, my, my mid 30s. Oh, okay. Mm, so okay. I have the idea. <laughs> mm. O van a ver películas okay. de, de policías. Hello, hello, the suspect, the suspect is Hispanic, mid 20s, tattoos mm. on his face. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, Jesus Christ on his arm. <laughs> No. Entonces así es, porque si se han dado cuenta, nadie, eh, lo que les digo en español, cuando decimos, ¿cuántos años tiene Sánchez Serén? No sé, sus 79, 74. Entonces, eh, mejor uno dice, early, mid, late. How old is that? ¿Cómo se llama la señora Isabela? <gasps> La ministra de María salud. Isa, María, María Isabel. 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 She How old is she? Is She's in her mid 100s. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no. Yeah. She's in her early 90s, no? Yeah. Uh, early 90s. No, mm, 94. Mid 90s. Mid no. I have been o como ella ya está en una situación que ya parece de 90 o de 100, mm -hmm. ahí también se puede generalizar. She's in her 90s. Mm. Repeat, please. Okay, in this situation, María Isabela, she, she, her, her aspect, she looks, she can be 90 years old or she can be 105 years old. Okay. Se ve igual. O sea, no. There's no difference. Mm -hmm. Like, for, for example, Bukele, okay, Bukele looks 40, but he doesn't look 50. So, ahí sí, no. You know, but... Look at this picture. No. Okay. Here's the celebration that 97 years old. That She is 97? 97 years old. 97 oh, my gosh. Years old. She is in her late 90s. Mm -hmm. Wow, that woman saw electricity, black and white TV, color TV, VHS, mm -hmm. <laughs> laser <laughs> disc, cassette. Wow, she's seen all the evolution. Can you can you see? No. no. Yes, see her. Yes. Uh, more or less. More or less. Uh, I got yeah, I see her. My her celebration. My yes. Wow. My teacher. Yes. ¿Cómo, cómo se dice bisabuelo? Great grandfather. Great grandfather. Mm -hmm. He he died last year and he was 100. 100 wow. years old. Wow, that's amazing. That's good. He had a good life. <laughs> yeah. My brother, my brother is a doctor and um, he works in OMS. Mm -hmm. So, en el último término, él trabajaba mucho con la doctora Isabela. Mm -hmm. Y me decía, pobrecita, porque a veces en las reuniones hablaba y de repente. Sí, está listo, sí. Mm -hmm. Se dormía y todos callados como. <coughs> but, when you, but when you say her, eh, you. Um, Pedir, eh, ask her, eh, ask her, eh, her opinion. She, uh, yes, I am, uh, no, 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 aquí ya está, ya. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yes. yes. <laughs> when can you make that when say? <laughs> <laughs> And the moment correct. She, she's very intelligent, no? Yes, very intelligent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very strict. There are more. Okay. All right, so. Eso solo era un tip para si un día, para dar un aproximo de edad o no quieren decir su edad o algo así, yo sé. Mm -hmm. You know. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, like, how old are you? Oh, bueno, cuando uno tiene 20, no anda escondiendo nada. I'm 20. <laughs> <laughs> o incluso dicen, tengo 20 y medio. I'm 20 and a half. <laughs> o en siete meses voy a tener 21. Wait, wait until you're like 38, 39, mm -hmm. like, how old are you? 
Uh, ya, yeah, yeah, ya estoy en los 30. Uh, no, ahí empieza. I'm in my mid, late 30s. And then when you're 40, you don't care. How old are you? I'm 43. I'm 44. I'm 50. <laughs> That's <laughs> no, actually, actually, no, you accept it and you're happy. Like, yeah, I am. I am cool at my age. I remember when I was 20 and people my age were old people. <laughs> I am cool. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to share the screen. Tell me if you can see it. Okay. Okay. So curiosity. Um, Lou, how old are you? Don't tell me exact. Give me the approximate. How old are you? I'm uh, I would, I'm in my sorry. <laughs> I guess uh, twenty early or early twenty. I am in my early twenties. Early twenties. So now we know that Lou is between twenty and twenty-three years old. Yes. Yeah. Jocelyn, how old are you? I am in my early 20s too. Okay, so all again, so we know that um, Jocelyn is between 20 and 23. Cool. All right, so let me share the screen. Tell me if you can see the screen, please. Can you see? Yes. 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 All right, it says let's celebrate. No, not again. Please open, please open, please open. There you go. Okay, here in this class, you will learn vocabulary from discussing a celebration. Okay. So we're gonna practice celebrations. Let's listen to the video. Tell me if you can hear it. Hi, are you ready to begin? I want you to follow me and repeat the words as they appear in your screen. Anniversary, cake, cards, dancing, fireworks, flowers, fruit punch, parade, presents, roast turkey, wedding. Before we continue, let's practice that vocabulary. Anniversary, we all know anniversary, right? Right. Yes. That's no problem, okay? Anniversary is no problem. One year more. Very good. Remember you may listen to the audio program as many times as you need to. Okay, cake, we understand cake. Yes. Cake. Cards, dancing, fireworks. Do you understand fireworks? Yes. Um, yes. 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 Yeah. The what Campero is? fireworks. Yeah, yeah, fireworks. Okay. Yeah, fireworks. Fireworks. <laughs> okay, flowers. We have fruit punch. Fruit, fruit punch and buen salvadoreño is tutti frutti. No. Y con spike is like a little vodka. <laughs> we have parade. You know what a parade is, correct? Parade. Yes. Defile? Yes. In El Salvador, every May 1, uh, May 1st, we have a parade. Unfortunately, it's something negative. Yes. But we have it. Uh, we have party, present, roast, turkey. And remember, it can be roast turkey, roast chicken, roast pig. 
do you remember maybe five or 10 years ago, Pollo Campero used to sell roast chicken? It was very good. And they stopped. Do you remember? No. Bonanza chicken, I remember. It's good, but it's very expensive. They are ridiculous. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it's like three seventy-five or four dollars por un cuarto. I don't know, but I think I think it can't bonanza era como pollo del pueblo de los pobres, right? Y hoy ya está caro. Okay, roast turkey, and we have a wedding. Who here is married? No. Nobody's married? Mm -mm. Evelyn, you're not married? No. Marlon, Jocelyn, I hope you're not married. You too, Luz, I hope you're not married. <laughs> no, please. <laughs> okay. Um, but weddings are cool. <laughs> I like going to weddings, they're, they're nice. Okay. So it says, by the end of this class, you will understand the use of relative clauses of time. Let's see. Oh my God. Hello, before you watch the video, I want you to know what. I Hello, before you watch the video, I want you to know what a relative clause is. So pay attention. A relative clause is used to define or identify the noun that precedes them. In this case, we will talk about the relative pronoun when, because we want to talk about time. Okay, let me see if there's another explanation here. Relative clauses of time. Thanksgiving is a day when North Americans celebrate the harvest. Do you understand what a clause is? In this case, it's a time clause. Listen to this. A clause, I'll make it easy for you. A clause is a group of words. What? Sorry? A, a group of words. Ah, okay. So, in this case, we have a time clause. If you notice when... It's a time word, correct? Mm -hmm. So after when is the clause, North Americans celebrate the harvest. Eso sería the time clause. Uh, teacher, what does it mean harvest? Cosecha. Uh, cosecha. Uh, Thank you, good question. So do you understand what a clause is? Miren, les recomiendo que se aprenda mucho, mucho que es un clause, porque hay muchas. Hay time clause, if clause, pero recuerden, un clause es un grupo de palabras que terminan de hablar de lo que es, o sea, si es time clause, ese grupo de palabras va después de la palabra que expresa el tiempo, que en este caso es when. Entonces sería when, oh, that's a time word. Entonces, when North Americans celebrate the harvest, that would be the time clause. Hay un if clause. If I had a million dollars, I would buy a house. Okay, so let's, let's hear this more. Remember February 14th is the day when people give cards to the ones they love. New Year's Eve is a night when I have fun with my friends. What is a relative clause of time? A relative clause of time refers to a time, date or moment previously mentioned. They are usually introduced by the verb be. Right after the verb be, a noun phrase may follow. Example, the day, the month, the year, the season. And because we're referring to time, we will use when. Take a look at the structure and work with us on the following examples. Date plus verb be plus a noun phrase plus a relative clause of time when plus complement. If we study the first example, 
Valentine's Day is a day when people give presents to their loved ones. Valentine's Day is the date, is is the verb be, a day, noun phrase, when, relative clause of time, people give presents to their loved ones would be the complement. Go on reading the other examples and try to understand them before you're asked to do the exercises. We want you to finish the following sentence using a relative pronoun when in our discussion box. Ready? Mother's Day is a day. A wedding anniversary is a time. December is a month. All right, let me see real quick. Leah, November 2 is? Relative times, closest times. No, no but can, can, you, can you finish the sentence? November 2 is? When? It's a day. Ah, uh -huh. it's a day. It's a time, I don't know. November 2. In El Salvador, it's when okay. it's when the people it's celebrate. It's a day. It's day. It's day. It's holiday. It's a kill day. No, kill day. Oh, no. oh my God! You can kill in November too. <laughs> no, the difuntos, difuntos. How do you say difuntos? <laughs> yeah, la muerte. Dead. dead. <laughs> it's the day of the dead. It's the day. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! It's holiday. Leah. It's holiday. <laughs> Very good. Imagínese, por ejemplo, un chino preguntando a Lía. Lía, what is November 2 in El Salvador? Oh, it's kill day. Kill day. What? Coming to visit. <laughs> Don't go to, to El Salvador. <laughs> Don't visit. No. In El no, Salvador but, all day. <laughs> Bingo. <laughs> no, but remember, uh, so basically it's November 2 is a day when people celebrate the day of the dead. Yeah, so remember, you have to mention the date and then is, remember, so November 2 is the day when people, people. celebrate the day of the dead. Luis, what is Black Friday? Is, is a day when the people to go to the mall to buy everything. Yeah. It's a day when people go crazy. Uh, maybe shopping. <laughs> yeah, shopping. Sandra, in El Salvador, what is Sunday? Sunday. A lo buen salvadoreño. Sunday is the day. Nunca llenaron en Facebook eh, que tan salvadoreño sos. ¿Qué día es el domingo? Uh, days. It's a weekend day. It's a day of pupusas. Yes. It's <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, the church day. The go to your church. Church day. Okay, but remember the objective here is to say Sunday is the day you uh, is the day you go to church. Okay. When when you go to church. So Sandra, can you please repeat? Sunday is the day. Sunday is the day go to the church. When you go to church. Uh, when when do you uh, when? You, you go to church. Go to church. Okay. Good. Okay. okay good. Mm -hmm. good. Me acuerdo que en ese formulario decía, Monday. de verdad que tan salvadoreño sos que como que decía, Tunco mató a tu papá, que uno ter termina la oración, que Tunco mató a tu papá y no sé qué. Mató mucho a tu tata. Ajá. O oh, cuál es la canción oficial de la selecta? El domingo es el día oficial de sopa de pata o pupusa, etc. Okay, let me see, let me see. Lou. Yes. What 
What is Valentine's Day? Uh, February. Uh, <laughs> sorry, February. I. No, but listen to my question. I didn't say uh -huh. when. When is Valentine's Day? I said what is uh, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is the day when people's uh, boy. <laughs> I I no. love the world. Uh, Valentine's Day is day when people give chocolate to their loves. To their loved ones. The loved ones. No. Okay, good. And the day before Valentine's Day is the day when you celebrate with your lover. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a joke. <laughs> Let me see. Beatriz, I saw you there. What happened? You, you lost. Okay, there you are. Hi, Beatriz. Hi. Hi. How are you? Um, I'm fine. Can you tell me what Friday the 13th is? No. What is Halloween? Um, it's a day when people um, celebrate the, the day. I don't know. The day of the devil. <laughs> exactly. But in El Salvador, it's not common. No. no, so, okay, perfecto. Entonces, ¿qué? no, pero hay gente que lo celebra. Indirecta o direct, indirectamente. Mm -hmm, yes. So, yes. entonces, pero, okay, so in El Salvador, Halloween is the day when you dress in, to, in your work, in your job. Mm -hmm. Yes, where do you work, Beatrice? Yeah. Um, I don't work. Oh, you don't? No. Oh, okay. Um, let me see, Evelyn, did you dress up in Halloween? No. <laughs> oh, you didn't? <laughs> No, it, it, the, all the day we we come on, we pass very busy. <laughs> oh, we're busy all day. We are busy all day. Okay. Mm -hmm. But then in IT, the last year we push a poster. How do you say? Poner un poster. We put a poster. Uh -huh, we put a poster in the door, and the of uh del payaso no sé ese payaso oh the clown it. Uh -huh. yeah and and it's... the name the name say mm -hmm. it no sé qué oh el because of it todo el uh -huh. hey okay that, that's <laughs> oh, okay that's cool Okay, so yeah, okay, it's a very good example because okay, yeah, Halloween is not a it's not a Salvadorian holiday or celebration, but now yes, bueno, hay gente que ya está celebrando no sé por qué el día de acción de gracias. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I I think because and now it's in twenty five November November twenty five. Yes, but people celebrated in El Salvador, like really, like I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. I mean, we celebrate it because we work in an American or Canadian company. Okay, yeah. So, okay. pero like in your house, really? No. <laughs> no. Yeah. Pronto vamos a celebrar cuatro de julio. Teacher. Yes. I I I have friends. They celebrate the four twenty. The what? The 420. What is 420? You don't know where is 420? No. For real. <laughs> the 420 is... Uh, never mind. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> now you have to explain to me. What is 420? <laughs> For real, you don't know where is 420? The 420 is, is the day when the people celebrate and they smoke. Oh, 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 wow. That, I think that's a, that's a, yeah, the, okay, 420. I think that's, that's a world holiday. Oh, okay, no, uh, yeah, I, okay, now I understand why 420. Okay. <laughs> there you go. 
Oh, but you know, if you practice that, it's okay to celebrate, I think. <laughs> okay, so let's see the knowledge check. Leah Campos, New Year's Day is a day when? <clears throat> New Year's Day. So I'm going to read it. You tell me. So New Year's Day is. Um, New Year's Day is a day when. When Brazilians celebrate a carnival, when people different. have parties with family and friends. Many young adults choose to get married. People in many countries honor workers. People express the love to someone or people sometimes play tricks on friends. Which one is people it? Have party, people have party with family and friends. Cool. Sandra, April Fool's Day is a day when? Um, Teacher, what does that mean, fools? Fool, tonto. April ah, okay. Fools. Pero aquí, ah, aquí quiero que le El Día de los Inocentes. El Día de los Inocentes. Okay. Pero en, en, en Estados Unidos es April Fools. April el primero de abril. Okay. All right, so Sandra. I think it's that people sometimes. Can you read it, please? Um. Uh, Sandra Karina. <laughs> okay. okay, maybe she can't hear. <laughs> Excuse oh, okay. me. No, it's okay. Okay, uh, people sometimes play tripped or framed. Very good. Let me see. Marlon, what is May and June are the months when? May and June are the months when? They have a celebration to the dead memory. June, June. Mm -hmm. Maybe June. People in many countries, uh, no, 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 no. Many young adults choose to get married. Yes. Okay, good. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's a tricky one. So Valentine's Day <laughs> is a day when, Jocelyn? Mm -mm. People's first day, yes. People express their love to someone. Aww. Love to someone. Labor Day. Labor Day. It's a worker. People in many countries. Worker, worker. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Uh, Evelyn, what is Labor Day? Hello, Evelyn. Okay, maybe. Sorry, Evelyn. I'm oh, muting. I speak. You're speaking on mute. It's okay. Yes. Labor Day is the day when people in many countries honor workers. Good. Except us, huh? Because we have to work. Yes. <laughs> okay, and February. Leah. I'm sorry, Luis Molina, what is February? February. February, February. Um, okay, Brazilian celebrate. Yes. Arnold. Yes. I will not die because one day I will go to a Brazilian carnival. I would like to. Yeah, that would be so cool. Submit, teacher. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, I didn't submit. Oh, I'm God, repeating it. No, but it's cool. Uh, <laughs> near, well, in my platform, it was okay. <laughs> okay, so listen, in this class, you will listen to an audio about a carnival. 
This will help you develop skills in listening for specific information. Okay, so practice your listening skills in this moment. Ready? It says, listening exercise, carnival time. Un así, un ante, un prem, miren que es, what is a carnival? How long does it last? When is it? When is it? What is the samba? What is the samba? Uh, sorry, when you say the, the, the second question, how long does it last? ¿Cuánto, como, ¿Cuánto tiempo dura? Exactly. Ah, okay. What how time? long does your lunch last? Oh, it lasts no. one hour. How long does your break last? It lasts mm -hmm. one hour. Ah, uh, okay. Or 10 minutes, I think. Uh, <laughs> okay, ready? Let's go. Let me see. Mike has just returned from Brazil. Listen to him talk about Carnival. What did he enjoy most about it? Isn't that music fantastic? It's from a samba CD that I got when I was in Rio for Carnival. Wow, Carnival in Rio is really something. It's a party that lasts for four whole days. It's held in late February or early March, but you need to book a hotel room way in advance because hotels fill up really quickly. Carnival is celebrated all over Brazil, but the most famous party is in Rio. The whole city is decorated with colored lights and streamers. It's really beautiful. Everyone is very friendly, especially to visitors from other countries. The best part about Carnival is the big parade. The costumes are unbelievable. People work on them for months. It's really fantastic to watch. Everyone dances the samba in the streets. I'd really recommend you go to Rio for Carnival if you ever have the chance. Page 52, Exercise 5, Part B. Listen again and answer these questions. Isn't that music fantastic? It's from a samba CD that I got when I was in Rio for Carnival. Wow, Carnival in Rio is really something. It's a party that lasts for four whole days. It's held in late February or early March, but you need to book a hotel room way in advance because hotels fill up really quickly. Carnival is celebrated all over Brazil, but the most famous party is in Rio. The whole city is decorated with colored lights and streamers. It's really beautiful. Everyone is very friendly, especially to visitors from other countries. The best part about Carnival is the big parade. The costumes are unbelievable. People work on them for months. It's really fantastic to watch. Everyone dances the samba in the streets. I'd really recommend you go to Rio for Carnival if you ever have the chance. All right. Now I want to, I want to go to Rio even more. Okay, what is a carnival? It's a more famous party in Brazil. What are <laughs> Yes. Um, in these days, I was doing this activity on my mm -hmm. computer and I can't submit my answers because the platform thinks that all my questions are wrong. <laughs> yeah, so I, I that was the platform. How I can I have to answer that in the input? Okay, so here we have some options. What it's a carnival? It's a party, or party, or party, or a carnival is a party. So let's say the first one. It's a party. <clears throat> It is a party. Oh man, there goes my. It is a party. Mm -hmm. 
How long does it last, Evelyn? Four. Four days. So what, it, but look, we have it lasts for four whole days. It lasts for four days. Four days. Or four days. Four whole days. For four and days. The four four whole days. Whole. What is whole? Four four Com four whole days. Complete. Whole. Twenty four hours. Yes. Whole is complete. Mm. And how how do you translate whole? Entero. Uh, what is? But what I'm sorry, I, I think it's the first one because of the capital letter. It's because, less. because it is a capital. When is it? When is it? In Brazil. In Brazil. Ah, when? When? In March. When? Okay, in forever, no. It is it's only February or early March. This and this? It's on late February or early March. I think so. Meaning I start late. So get mm -hmm. late February. Mm -hmm. Late February. Yeah. I think. Yeah, 25, 26, 27. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is samba, Evelyn? Samba. It's a dance. Or dance. Marta. Mm -hmm. It's a dance. It's That's a samba. Dance. Is a dance? It's a, a dance. dance. No, the samba okay, the is thing a dance. here, this one is correct. Mm -hmm. The samba is. It's a dance is correct. It is a dance is correct. But it's it's a, the they're all correct. A they are a all correct. Dance, a dance is short, but. Let's try that one. I know it's going to be wrong, but the four are correct. A dance. Ah. <laughs> Why? Because you <laughs> it lasts only as four hours. It lasts delete. Why is this wrong? It lasts. Last it lasts. Attend. Maybe yeah. for the dot. <laughs> yes, it's for the dot. I try. Uh, it is a body without dot. And um, mark wrong. Is is the dot? Oh, there you go. Yes. It's not a dot. It's, it's a period. Size, it's space. Yeah. Uh, yes. Si es escritura, it's a period. Ah, how do you spell that? <laughs> periodo. Peri period. 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 Okay. I will do it right now. Period. Period. Um, y disculpen, pero este es vocabulario también. Um, también cuando la mujer anda en su menstruación, eh, pueden decir, um, I am on my period. Mm, okay. Okay, es, es una forma formal y it's, it's formal, normal. Okay. Okay. Y incluso la más común porque casi nadie dice, I am on my menstruation. Mm -hmm. O la regla, hay mucha gente que dice regla y en inglés, I am on my ruler y no. <laughs> yeah, in English it's not correct. Entonces, sí, el, el, el común es menstruation o period, pero todo el mundo dice, bueno, todo el mundo, todas las mujeres dicen period. Okay. 
Okay, in this session, what was that? Bang. The taser. <laughs> in this session, you will listen and practice a conversation about wedding costumes. Adverbial clauses of time will be introduced. So let's see the conversation is the wedding day. Hi, listen to the following conversation and find out how people in Japan celebrate their weddings. Pay attention to what they do before and after a ceremony. Listen and practice. Your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you. Those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Where was the ceremony? At a shrine. When people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. That's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But afterward, we had a reception with family and friends. So, what are receptions like in Japan? There's a big dinner. And after the food is served, the guests give speeches or sing songs. It sounds like fun. It really is. And then, before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. The guests get presents? Yes. And the guests give money to the bride and groom. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What did the bride and groom give each guest? I'm curious. What did you and your husband give everyone? Well, sugar is a symbol of happiness in Japan, so we gave each guest a ceramic box filled with sweets. What a nice custom. It sounds like it was a wonderful day. Oh, it really was. All right. Questions? The symbol, the, I don't understand. The what, I'm sorry? And she said, uh, uh, she talked about a, a symbol. Let me see. Let's hear it again. Mm -hmm. And stop me where, where your question is. Okay. Hi, listen to the following conversation and find out how people in Japan celebrate their weddings. Pay attention to what they do before and after a ceremony. Listen and practice. Your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you. Those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Where was the ceremony? At a shrine. When people get married in Japan, they sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. That's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But afterward, we had a reception with family and friends. So, what are receptions like in Japan? There's a big dinner, and after the food is served, the guests give speeches or sing songs. It sounds like fun. It really is. And then, before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. The guests get presents? Yes. And the guests give money to the bride and groom. Listen to the rest of the conversation. Oh, no, I, I what do the bride the same and groom problem. give each guest? I'm curious. What did you and your husband give everyone? Well, sugar is a symbol of happiness in Japan. So we gave each guest a ceramic box filled with sweets. What a nice custom. It sounds like it was a wonderful day. Oh, it really was. No, oh. I, I, I creo que me confundí. <laughs> okay, but it, it was saying that when people in Japan, when they get married, the couple, they give presents to the guests, a los invitados. Mm -hmm. But imagine they gave them candy. Well, <laughs> 
That's cool, man. Si fuera aquí, I, I would go to Dollar City and buy chocolitos. <laughs> okay, people, chocolate for everybody. <laughs> okay, class. Let's, yes. Uh, groom. ¿Cómo se traduciría? Groom. Yes. Very Bride good. Is a novia. Entonces, ¿qué sería groom? Novio, pero ya exactly. es el plan de boda. Sí, a groom. Groom prácticamente solo y igual a bride. Uno es bride mm -hmm. solo un día y el groom también. Ah, ok. Es, ese día es él es el novio, el groom. Okay. Thank you. Un día anterior, he's the boyfriend o el fiancé. <laughs> ok. <laughs> yeah. Entonces, es the groom. Ok, class, um, have a very nice weekend, ok? We'll continue next week. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, it's Friday. Thank you very much. It's Friday. Go party or go to sleep. Okay, go no. to sleep. sleep. Going to start. Sleep. Sleep, <laughs> please. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, have a great, great thank weekend. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.